Good morning, children. Lesson number twelve, perimeter and area is going on with us. Okay. And yesterday we have solved some questions from practice set forty-five. So let's see, children. Uh, it is practice set forty-six. <clears throat> a page of a calendar is forty-five centimeter long and twenty-six centimeter wide. What is its area? Okay. See, children. Length and breadth is given. That means what? What is the shape of the calendar page? Yes, it is the rectangular. Okay. Okay, so the shape of the uh, page of calendar is rectangular, and we have to find the area. Okay, so let's start. Edge equals to forty-five centimeter. B equals to twenty-six centimeter. Okay, and area is denoted by the capital letter A. So, what is the formula to find the area of a rectangle? Yes, it is L into B. So it is forty-five multiplied by twenty-six. Forty-five multiplied by twenty-six is one one seven zero. Okay, I see. Unit centimeter into centimeter, centimeter square, or you can write S Q for square centimeter. Got it, Madam? Question number two: What is the area of a triangle with base four point eight centimeter and height three point six centimeter? Okay, so yesterday we have seen the area of the triangle. It is half into B into H. B for base and H for height. Okay, so let's solve. It is a triangle. Okay, so here B B for base is given four point eight centimeter. Height means H is given eight point six centimeter. And you have to find the area. Okay, area formula is half into base. Into height. Got it, Peter? And now put the values of B and H. It is half into B, four point eight into three point 
six. So you can divide this two and four point eight, or you can divide three point six by two. Okay. So two ones are two, two twos are four, two fours are eight. So it is two point four, and this equals to eight point. Sixty-four. Again, see, children, it is the area. That's why its unit is centimeter square. Or you can write like this: square centimeter. Got it, Bata? Square centimeter. Okay. Now, see the other question. What is the value of rectangular plot of land? What is Yes, the shape of the plot is rectangular. Okay, and its length is seventy-five point five meter, and it is thirty point five meter wide. You have to find the rate of hundred rupees per square. Okay. So how will you find better? Here we have to find the area of the plot, and whatever the area of the plot we get, if you multiply it by one thousand, right? Because it is per square meter, one thousand rupees per square meter. So we will get the cost of the plot. Okay. So area equals to L into B. Length is what seventy five point five, and breadth is thirty point five. Okay. Now multiply it seventy five point five and thirty point five, and the answer is two three zero two. Point seven. See children, here the decimal point is after one, one. So total two place. That's why we are putting decimal point here after two place from the rightmost side. It is the area. So we will write unit meter square. Okay. Now what to do? Find Value of the plot is rupees. 
rupees one thousand per meter square. And here the square meters are two three zero two point seven five. So we will multiply it by one thousand. Okay, and is equal to area multiplied by rate. And the area is two three zero two. Rate is one thousand. So how we will find? So we will write the number as it is without decimal point, and we'll put three zeros. Two three zero two seven five. Okay, and one two three. One two three. Okay. Now see the position of decimal point is one two. It is after two place. Now we will put the decimal point after two place from the rightmost side. One two. It is here, and the answer is a rupees. Why? Because it is the value of the plot. And it is two lakh thirty thousand two hundred and seventy five. Got it, Peter? <coughs> and now see the next question. If the sides that form the right angle of a triangle are Find the area of the triangle. Okay, so here, see children. It is not mentioned. It is the base and it is the height. Okay, so we will take any one is the base and any is the height. Okay, or you can take side one or side two. Hello, no? right angle triangle has three sides, and this side which is opposite to the right angle is hypotenuse. Okay, that's why these two sides are given, and we need only these two. So area of the triangle R multiplied by you can say side one into side two. Sides are given, so you can write side one into side two. Or you can write base into height. Okay. Ah, uh, side one is three point five, and side two is four point two. 
See children, here is the two is in the denominator. So you can cancel it by 3.5 or you can 4.2, you can, but you can't 3.2. If you divide it by 2, again you will get the answer in the decimal point. Okay, so we will divide 4.2. 2 ones are 2, 2 twos are 4 and 2 ones are 2. See, the decimal point is after one place. Means it is 2.1. Now what is left with a 3.5 and 2.1? So it is 7.35 units are given in centimeter. Therefore, its unit is centimeter square. Got it, Vita? Now see the next question. I am giving you this question as a homework. So this question is the homework for you. Got it, Peter? So, here, base is given 5.6. Height is given 4.5. Okay, see, 5.6. It is the even number. Okay, now apply the formula of the triangle. Half into base into height. And cut this 5.6 by 2. And I like this. Okay. Half into 5.6 into 4.5. See, here the unit test has 5. So, better to divide 5.6 by 2. 2 ones are 2, 2 twos are 4, carry 1, 2.8. And then multiply both of them. Okay? Got it? So, here we are stop children. Bye-bye,